now before we, we wrap things up, um, I, I just want to hear more about um, what you, because you, because uh, after today, yeah, we're, we're, we're like you are you are on your uh, way to push forward and follow through with your um, your inspirational talks and yes, all that yes. stuff. So, so this we'll morning share. I was working on my website. I saw you. Know, I'm so proud because like I, I've been t- I've been trying I've been trying to get you to do a logo and like because I've, I've been I've been here for a while. I was like, yeah. hey, dude, and I know you've been busy, but yeah. I, I I'm, I've been trying to encourage you like get your logo done and all stuff. And I and you, you you started doing everything, so I'm really proud of you. Yeah, and what's crazy is I've been doing this for years. So I've I started like a YouTube channel probably three or four years ago. Mm-hmm. And randomly, I would just go on Instagram and like give a motivational talk or yeah. inspirational. And one of my friends, Larry, shout out to Larry, um, he you, messaged me and was like, you need to start a YouTube channel. That way I can share this stuff because yeah. you have such good information that you're giving out to people. Like you need to be able to share it. Mm-hmm. And then I started getting other people telling me the same thing. So this was like 2016, 2017 that this was happening. So fast forward, I started like a YouTube channel and I didn't really follow through with it. And then now that I started this um, Instagram, then that kind of started growing and and becoming its own thing. And I feel like all of this stuff I already had, like I had made the Motivational Talks with Ash logo years ago. Mm -hmm. And now I'm able to like take all this stuff that I had from over the years and put it all together. So I brought something. Oh, we have visual, visual. See, this is why I have the cat with the zone doing the camera now because we yes. have visual aids. And so <laughs> like I'm saying, I've been, I've been working on this kind of stuff for years now doing my own work. Mm-hmm. And, um, I wrote a purpose statement. So like my life nice. statement for what your purpose is. And I've had this hanging in my room. Awesome. Right here, I had this hanging in my room on my pushpin board, and I've been, I look at it every day. That's great. And today I was making my website, and it says, like, What's your purpose? And there staring at me is my life purpose statement, like, <laughs> where I'm like, I don't know, like, this is a really great question. Well, and then I look straight ahead, and I'm like, my, It's it. right here. Let's so. Hear it. Let's hear it. It, my life purpose is to use my optimism and courage to inspire and motivate people to live at peace. So I wrote this like nice. five years ago. Nice. And five, I'm thinking about you five years ago. I, I, I know where you're at five years ago. <laughs> yeah. And, and it's crazy because I, I hadn't like really figured out how I was going to do this. Yeah. Right. It's been something that's kind of like come and gone and come and gone and. I feel like there was a lot of fear in like putting myself out there and like really exposing myself, like being vulnerable. Mm -hmm. There's a really great um, Netflix series by Brene Brown. She does a TED talk on vulnerability. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I think a big part of it is like being able to be vulnerable and like really exposing yourself and like telling your truth. I feel like that's scary. It that is, is scary. very scary. scary. I like literally yeah. woke yeah. up the other night and I was like, <gasps> like scaring yeah. myself yeah. Yeah. thinking yeah. about yeah. like, you know, the people that might have known me before, like when I was in a completely different time and like, mm-hmm. you know, but I feel like everything that I've been doing has been leading me up to this. And so now I've um, created a course. I created a website. It's for single ladies that are looking to upgrade their lives in 2023 if you've gone through a breakup in the last year and you are looking to just really find yourself and i want to help you motivate Mm -hmm. you inspire you and give you some of the tools that i've learned over the last few years so you don't have to go through a lot of the same things that i went through yeah and 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 you know um i i want to encourage Anyone, I mean, like I know it's for single ladies, yeah. uh, but but like uh, anyone who is single and, and going through like like dependency problems because they're like I don't want to be alone. It's okay. You can find your own self value. Like you're, the, you're like on, honestly, as somebody who's been single for a long time, uh, I, I I I just I want to encourage everybody to like know that like self love is so important. Yes. Like, like to value yourself and yes. know your value. Yes. Because uh, if if you're if you have been just always dating and always been mm-hmm. in relationships and like needing validation from that, like, yeah. like I, I understand it's fun, but like once you like really discover that, like I'm a badass, you know, like I, Heck yeah. I know, I know who I am and mm-hmm. I know my value, you know? And I think once you discover that, like the universe 
feels that you know and, and like they just like things things progress because you, you 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 don't care you're like you have no limitations because you are reliant on on your truest self you Absolutely. know so i'm so yeah. glad that you're providing that for for women you know and, and i think that's uh so important because yeah. um i mean there's so many times where i see my friends just my female friends go from guy to guy and there's like oh another jerk like well you, you have a habit so like, yeah maybe and, you should like take back a little bit and i was yourself. there i'm yeah. i'm not gonna lie to you like i was there before you know i was a serial relationship yeah. I guess you could say I was in long term relationships. And as soon as I got out of a relationship, boom, I was in another one. Like, yeah, yeah. I couldn't be alone. I didn't know how to be alone. Yeah. And I did not like being alone. And no, I, I feel I like relate. now that I've, I've been on this journey, I love being alone. Oh my God. I'm not yeah, gonna lie. Yeah. Like, my bed is awesome. Have and you're... I have a giant unicorn that uh -huh. I sleep with yeah, every night. Yeah, so. no, I'm all, I, dinner by myself, you know, like getting sushi myself. It's like no one's like, I, I'm not, not saying that my date would bother me, but like, there's something about like just being in your own zone, being in your yeah. own space, you know, like, like I, yeah. I, I love, I love going to movie theaters. But I know it's crazy. I, I you know, on TikTok, there's people like, I went to Disneyland alone. Like who gives a fuck? I go alone. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I love going. Single rider is my line. Let me tell you. Right. Cause then you don't have to wait in the line forever. I'm telling you that single rider thing. Like that's yeah, real. Yeah, yeah. That's awesome. Plus you meet single people in that line too sometimes. <laughs> so yeah. Like, that works out as well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I feel like, you know, last year, I, I spent a lot of time really alone because I, after going through everything, I wound up getting shingles, which is I terrible. Remember you told me that. Yeah, 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 like yeah. if you've ever had chicken pox as a kid, be careful because it'll come back when you're older. Shingles in your eyes? No, no it's, okay. it can be anywhere on your body. Okay, I've, but, I've, 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 had, I've had relatives with it in their eyes. Oh, or not in their eyes, terrible. but like, like just, you know, like the crab, it's like the eyelid and stuff yeah. you know but so, that's uncomfortable it's pretty much like the adult version of chicken pox and my roommate's son isn't has never had it before so if you have chingles you can give it to somebody that's never had chicken pox so i literally uh, had to lock myself in my room for like a good more, week <laughs> the one thing we love after 2020 more quarantine <laughs> yes exactly and it, you know the keyword oh man yes so i i i spent a lot of time alone last year and really like got to know myself and and really create that strong value and that strong yeah. love and now that i have you. that it's just like unless you're going to give me the same thing i don't want it yeah and i've had a lot of opportunities recently like where I'm just like, no. <laughs> Somebody's well, bragging. <laughs> well, not, in, not even that. Not in that type no, no, of way. Okay, like, I, I don't mean it in that type of way. I just mean it in, like, my value for myself has yeah. gone up so Which I'm much proud more. You for. Thank I'm you. Really proud you for. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where it's like, it's not that I don't have opportunities or that I, I just don't want that. And I feel like right now, where I'm at, I'm so focused on my goals and what I want to do and what I want to achieve. I just want to help other people. Yeah. And if I can help at least one other woman that was in that same space that mm -hmm. I was before, like that would be phenomenal. I want to apologize. Cause you, you're really being very heartfelt and my dog is just <laughs> sniffing your butt and scratching yourself. And so I, if you're listening and watching and hearing this, I'm sorry for my dog. She <laughs> is, I forgot that she was in the room. Oh. And she was supposed to be outside, and now she's just licking away, oh making all gosh. this noise. Oh, Sheba. It's okay. Sheba. Um, yeah, I love her, but she's a noisy dog. Uh, before we end this, um, we uh, you did a lot, you, you did give a lot of inspirational things to talk about, but um, I do like to end my podcast with um, anything you want to share with any uh, younger or or anyone who needs uh advice on, on anything you could be like hey we're clean underwear whatever <laughs> whatever you think uh you want to share with that person who is listening today oh uh, that's please tough. share um that. if you want to learn more then join me <laughs> join me february <laughs> okay if you're ready to rip off that band-aid all right i'm here to help you do it all right I'm ladies here to help you do it, um, so. yeah and, and, and you know what strong independent women uh is very needed uh because i think I I, th I think I think a lot. Of, I feel like a lot of women doubt themselves when they're not mm -hmm. in really like some people. I mean, I'm, there are a lot of strong women out there. I'm mm -hmm. I'm related to a few, uh, but I think some women once they don't have a relationship or maybe maybe they they don't they don't they're not attracting as many men as they used to. They they feel mm -hmm. less valued and you know and also there are so many like toxic, bad podcasts and things that are online that right now that are are trying to um, devalue 
uh, anyone because of whatever their stature, their looks, their 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 income, you know. But I, I, I want to ensure everybody that that doesn't define you. Yeah. You know, you could you watch all the all the alpha male podcasts, but in reality, you define what you do. You know, so you have every power to change what you want to do and, and be who you want to be. Yeah, you know, until, and, until and you're dead, more- you have every chance to be. Yeah. Better. And the more yeah. you change inward, the more it's going to reflect yeah. outward yeah. in so many different ways. Once you change, you know, everything about you on the inside, it reflects because yeah. you start to love yourself more. So you take care of yourself better. You do more for yourself. And that self care and that self love is life changing yeah, because for sure. then you don't need somebody outside of you. And when you find somebody that is outside of you that makes that better and like can add to that. Then it's like, it's just, it brings your whole life to a whole yeah. other level. Yeah. And then you create that self-love. And the more love that you give outward, the more it's going to come back to you. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited, I'm excited for you too. So, um, yeah. once again, Ash, I'm really proud of you as Thank a friend. You. I'm proud of you too. Oh, I, I try. <laughs> <laughs> I put on clean underwear. What can I say? Good job. Uh, <laughs> good job. I'm proud of you. That's, first of all, that's on my wall, clean underwear. Um, but uh, we're, I guess we're going to cap it from now. Uh, and uh, I'll, I'll put all the links to Ash's. Um, yes. All, all, all her, her Single channel. Single ladies, join all me. All the things will be on, on the, on the um, description down below. And please follow Ash on all her accounts uh, for yeah. all her information. And uh, keep up with the, if you keep up so instagram and things we'll also let you know when we're, yeah. we're we're all also performing at disneyland many times and and knots and other places so uh there's always opportunities to see us in person oh. uh so with that said uh i want to wish i want to say to you guys uh be safe be kind and always be yourselves uh, my name is qatar and this is the unplugged podcast thank you so much for watching subscribe all that stuff find us and uh Tell us what you think about the podcast. And uh, yeah, if you want more topics, more guests, let me know. Uh, I'm excited to be doing this again. Yeah, Thank you, too. Ash, for Thank your you time. For of course, of course. Thanks Appreciate for being uh, back on, on season two. Yes. Guest number one. What's first episode oh. of many to come back. If you're not first, yeah. you're last. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, guys. Be safe. Be kind. Be you. Have a good night. Thanks. Thanks again for checking out this episode of Unplugged. Just a reminder, don't forget we are on Apple Podcast, Spotify, as well as Pandora, Amazon Music and anywhere podcasts are found. But thank you so much, guys, for watching. I will see you on the next episode. Be safe, be kind, be you. Peace.